Okay, so a very good question was asked on the channel that in patients of long bone fractures, when they have fat embolism syndrome, whether we should use heparin in such patients and whether we should use steroids in such patients. So understand that the pathophysiology of fat embolism is twofold. There are two theories. One, it is because of the mechanical obstruction, the fat globules goes into the intravascular, obstruct the respiration like that and all. Secondly, because the fat globules releases inflammatory markers and there is a systemic inflammatory response because of things get worse. So definitely it's not a thrombus. So heparin per se doesn't have any role. In fact, some studies have shown that if you are giving heparin per se because of fat embolism, it may harm. For DVT and other thing you can give, but not for fat embolism. Secondly, steroid role is still controversial. At times it may benefit, at times it may not benefit. So it depends upon the clinical conditions. You, it's case to case basis. So I hope, I hope this helps. Do read more about it.